inside of her page welcome to my channel welcome back to my channel if you're new definitely go ahead and say hit that subscribe button hit the bell so you won't miss out on any of these notifications of your og welcome back our fam let's get this started okay then y'all so today i figured i <laughs> would end up doing something with my hair y'all not gonna lie here lately i have just been wearing my twist in my hair i literally just took them out been pulling them back usually i'll pop on my baseball cap workout that's pretty much it y'all literally for my hairstyles these days so i figured i would just go into another simple lazy natural hairstyle which is the puff but i'm going to do a low puff i'm not really like a fan of having something sitting on top of my head i'm sorry y'all it does look good for certain people not gonna lie about that but just for my face shape my face structure and everything i just don't think that i just don't like it <laughs> that's kind of like how i am about metal parts so either way y'all i am going to go ahead and start off with parting my hair and i'm just gonna of course do a side part kick it to the side y'all so now that i feel like my part is about as straight as it's gonna get y'all because i'm up here keep doing the same part and feel like my scalp gonna start bleeding <laughs> i ain't got time for that but um i'm gonna go ahead and spray my hair y'all of course got to spray it this aloe vera water because y'all know i'm back using my aloe vera water because i do feel like i've been slacking I'm really just trying to get the top part pretty much everywhere I'm gonna lay. Spray across the back. Yeah, pretty much everywhere, y'all, except for the ends. It's not what I'm trying to get wet. I'm going with my hard bristle brush. Y'all, I recently bought this brush. This brush is the definition of a hard bristle brush. Y'all, I swear. Um Sometimes I like it, sometimes I'm like, ouch, you know? Like, I now I'm trying to have some edges now. I'm growing my hair and not stripping it out, brush. <laughs> but no, it doesn't feel like it's taking out my hair. It's never no hair in the brush, really. But this really is a hard bristle brush, y'all. This lot of body. Body, 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 body. I hate that song, y'all. I love Meg Thee Stallion. I do hate that song. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to go in with about that much. And you'll be surprised. Like, I see people usually using this stuff to do, um, what's it called? The flexi rods. But you will be surprised, y'all. Like, this stuff, I used it one other time to slick back my hair. And, y'all, it works. Like, literally, it works. So, I would not say this is just for curly like if you're trying to get curls and everything because like it tames frizz so i think that's the reason why when i did it before y'all my hair was slick mm -hmm. i just pulled my hair back using a scrunchie which i'm not going to use that at the end but I'm go ahead and use this eco styler having used it yet i know it was all hyped up a while back but your girl is just now getting it and here lately i haven't been using no gel i'm not even gonna lie so this is definitely me stepping out of my comfort zone and using a gel at that a new gel so i'm using the eco styler olive oil shea butter black castle black seed gel and we about to go in like like that y'all like it's a nice yellow shiny gold color oh my goodness smells good and while my hair is still back in the um, ponytail right now, I'm going to take the brush again. Start my edges just brushing really lightly now. So I'm not even, I'm really just using the side of the brush. And just really lightly, y'all. Uh,
moisturizing my ends, making sure the ends of my hair was well and moisturized because y'all, I don't be wearing my hair out no more. I'm dead serious. Like, so me wearing a puff is like stepping out of at my comfort zone right now, y'all, because I've been trying to protect my ends as much as possible. But yeah, I figured I would step out of my comfort zone and wear my hair down today. So that's definitely what we're working with. Another thing I ended up taking off the hair ties because I only do that step to get my hair nice and slicked back is the reason I do that while it's tied up. And then I take those off and then I go in with my shoelace. That's just a few steps that I do. Maybe it's extra, I don't know, but that's just the way I feel that my hair stays slicked down better on top has less flyaways than if I just went in with the shoelace first. And like I said, it's probably just me. Not saying everybody has to do it that way, but it definitely works for me. So that is something that I started doing after last time I did a low puff. And yeah, y'all, so this is it. It's just, you can tell the growth is there. So I'm definitely excited. And I still can't wait till the fall of this year and winter to straighten my hair. It'll be two years. I haven't used any heat. So, yeah. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. As usual, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Share, sharing is always caring. I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.